everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're exploring soulfrontrunner.com, an open source MEV bot that could revolutionize Solana trading. This bot front runs transactions, capitalizing on MEV by sandwiching trades. So how does the bot work? It scans the mempool, spots pending swaps on decentralized exchanges like Radium, then places a higher gas bid to execute first, followed by an instant sell, profiting from slippage. The best part, it's open source, so you can tweak or deploy your own version. If you're into Solana trading, this is a game changer. Let's dive in. So this is the website for the MEV bot Sol frontrunner.com. You can find the link in the description. Uh, here we can see the key features of the bot. As we can see, it uses AI powered scans to detect rugs and avoid them. And also lets you customize the access rights the bot has to your wallet. And these are the steps. So the first step is to give your bot a name. And after that, you will get the option to give the bot what access rights you want and then attach your wallet. We'll get into that when I show you how to set up the bot. And after that, add liquidity to the bot's contract. The minimum is 0.36 Solana, so the bot doesn't burn through your funds with the gas fees. And the last step is to start the bot that will use your liquidity to take trades. And it has a bunch of great security measures to keep your funds safe, like anti-rug scans, regular security audits, and encrypted data storage. Now let's get into the code to see how it works. Okay, let's get into the main functions first. As we can see, it imports Radians AMM liquidity library and uses this config for trading. And this function monitors price changes and transactions across exchanges and checks for profitable opportunities. And here is where it creates the trades for profitable opportunities and estimates the profit. Here are functions for calculating your balance before and after. And here it actually performs the trades. And here it adds the profit to your liquidity pool. Now let's get into the CEX functions. So this function basically fetches pending transactions from order books across exchanges. and calculates the amount it can buy or sell based on your liquidity. And here it creates the buy or sell order transactions. Now let's get into the Radium AMM function. Okay, so this basically puts the transactions together and sends them over to the bot so it can execute them. Here it uses the Radium smart contract address to import the token pairs being swapped. Let's check if this is the official Radium contract address. Perfect. As we can see, it is now back to the code. <laughs> Here it uses the token program contract to import token addresses and pair them with Wrap Solana. Let's check if this is the official token program contract. Perfect. It is the official contract. And this is the Serum program contract address, which is used to tell Radium what token to swap with wrapped Solana. As we can see, this is the official contract. And down here, we can see it communicates with Radium. And this is the official wrapped Solana contract address, which pairs with the token being swapped in Radium. Let's double check that too. Okay, perfect. It's the official wrapped Solana address. Okay, enough of this. Let's set up the bot. Okay, first click, start trading. Now, then enter your bot's name. I'm gonna call mine MVVBot1 for this video. Now 
here's where you create the bot smart contract and give it the rights for using your liquidity. Here you want to have a wallet with Solana in it to pay the fee for creating the smart contract, which can be a couple dollars. Now the swap and read tokens rights are required, but without the withdrawal and deposit rights, the bot won't be able to take trades with your liquidity and send you your profits back, making the bot basically useless. So you need to give it these rights now. Just connect your wallet. As we can see, it has many options, but I recommend Phantom for faster and safer transactions. Okay, now click verify to create your smart contract. Um, now, Phantom will give us this warning. This is totally normal because it's deploying a new smart contract, which isn't verified since it's new, but it will be verified after a day. Just click proceed. As we can see, this is the fee for creating the contract, but it can be up to 0.1 Sol. I got lucky today, just confirm everything and check this box. Okay, now the bot is live. Now you need to attach a second wallet address to the bot, which will be used for liquidity. Simply uh, just open Phantom and create a new wallet. and paste the wallet address here. Now add the liquidity you would like the bot to use from your second address and make sure you open the wallet from where you are adding the liquidity. The minimum is 0.36, but it'll be using two for this video so the bot can make more profit faster. Then click next and the liquidity will be added to the attached wallet address. Okay, now start the bot. Okay, here we can see the tokens, it's trading, and here we can see the failed and successful transactions. I'm gonna let this run for 30 minutes. You can skip 40 seconds to skip this time lapse. Okay, it's been around 30 minutes and it made 1.1 sol. Not bad, around a 60% profit. Now to withdraw your profit, just stop the bot and it will send your profits to the attached wallet address. Okay, let me check Phantom. Nice, sent me my profits. As we can see, they take little fee on withdrawals, but it's not too much. Let me verify the transaction on SolScan. Okay, perfect. Send it pretty quickly. Now I'm going to send my profits back to my main wallet. Hmm. Okay, perfect. I started this video with 3.5 Solana in this wallet. Now I have 4.6. Not bad at all. Well, that wraps up the video. If this helped you, make sure to like and subscribe. And if you need any help, feel free to message me on Telegram. It'll put my Telegram in the description. Peace.